Unveiling Nationalistic Fervor, A Dive into Patriotic Passion. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we demystify the English language for learners worldwide. Today, we're diving into a powerful phrase that often pops up in news, history, and discussions about patriotism, nationalistic fervor. By the end of this video, you'll understand not just the meaning but the context in which this phrase is used. So, let's embark on this linguistic journey together. First things first, let's break down nationalistic fervor into two parts to understand its components better. Nationalistic. This adjective relates to nationalism, which is a sense of pride in one's country. It's about identifying strongly with your nation and often putting its interests above others. Fervor. Fervor is intense and passionate feeling. When someone has fervor, they feel very strongly and enthusiastically about something. When combined, nationalistic fervor describes a powerful, passionate, and intense love and pride for one's country. It's a feeling that can inspire people to great deeds, but as we'll see, it has a complex side too. Understanding nationalistic fervor requires a bit of a history lesson. Throughout history, this intense patriotic passion has been a driving force behind significant events, from revolutions to the formation of new nations. It has rallied communities to support wars, defend their homeland, and even participate in national movements. For example, during the American Revolution, the colonists' nationalistic fervor helped them to unite against British rule. Similarly, in the 20th century, Many countries fighting for independence from colonial powers were fueled by a strong sense of nationalism. However, nationalistic fervor is not always positive. It's a double-edged sword. On one hand, it can foster unity, pride, and a sense of belonging. On the other hand, it can lead to exclusion, xenophobia, and even conflict if it turns into an extreme belief that one's country is superior to all others. It's crucial to recognize the difference between healthy patriotism and aggressive nationalism. The former celebrates one's country while respecting others, whereas the latter can alienate and divide. And that wraps up our exploration of nationalistic fervor. We've seen how this intense patriotic passion can unite and inspire, but also how it must be approached with caution to avoid its darker implications. Remember, understanding the nuances of phrases like these can enrich your comprehension of English and offer insights into the cultural and historical contexts that shape our world. Thank you for joining us today. We hope this video has illuminated the concept of nationalistic fervor for you. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more language learning tips. See you in the next video.